Hello and uh, welcome friends, welcome to another exciting unboxing. This time will be quite an expensive unboxing because the content of this pack that I've just got from the post office is 934 lace or 188.76 euros or almost $200 to be exact, 199.09 American dollars. So quite a small pack for such a great value, but I'm sure you will like the content of this pack, guys. So without further delay, I have here my little scissors. I have here also a little knife and uh, we will try to open it as good as we can. On one side it is the address, so I will take that out if I can, but let me see. It is quite well wrapped and I don't know how long it will take me to open it. The box is quite simple, so I don't want to preserve it. Let me take out those let me see how I can open it so unfortunately guys I will have to ruin the box I will use my scissors to make a little cut here okay and now I will try to cut it like this to cut the cardboard because the box is made out of cardboard and I will simply take the content right from inside of it I hope I won't no I want to ruin them so this is the content this is just okay so all the goodies should be right here in this pack and I don't have time to... I will use also my scissors just to remove this stuff from here so I can open it. Yes. This is one. I will put it right here. This is the second. A beautiful, beautiful thing. And the other ones are, I think, right here. So I need to use again my little scissors. Okay. I have another one here. And it should be... Yes, another one here. So this is the content. Boys and girls. And what can I say? I have here a beautiful, beautiful set. A celluloid from the 1930s that contains those three pieces. So one, you can recognize it. It is a simple letter opener. And uh, quite, quite nice in uh, amazing shape for its age. The second one is a mechanical pencil, you can see right here. Interesting that we don't have the name of the producer stamp on the caps. And this is a dip pen, but without the nib. So part of the same set, guys. And just for those here, I don't know, I, I think I paid around... Um, um, maybe a half half of the sum of the total collet of the total pack so around uh, let's say 90 euros or 100 american dollars around that sum maybe i paid a little bit less for them because i was surprised that i bought this at a really really good price guys so this around 90 euros or 100 american dollars and what is this beauty guys so this is a parker a beautiful beautiful parker 
I'm not so sure if it's the Sentinel or the Duofold, the new version of it, but I know for sure that it has this wonderful, wonderful body in this gorgeous, gorgeous color. And when I unscrew it, you will see a beautiful, beautiful two-tone gold nib in the shape of an arrow. So look at it, an 18 carat one, a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful nib. So 18 carat we have here and another hallmark 7750 seven over here. A wonderful, wonderful piece. I was curious to see if we have a, a ink converter or just an ink cartridge, but it came also with its ink converter. So a wonderful, wonderful piece at a quite reasonable, reasonable price. So I told the seller that uh, this is worth at least 200 euros in my point of view, but she was so kind and she said, because I bought the 1930s set, I can make her an offer and I made her uh, this offer and uh, she agreed. She said, okay, this is um, a good thing. I will talk to my husband and thank you. Thank you for allowing me to have this beautiful, beautiful Parker in my collection because at uh, the prices that they are sold on eBay, I thought I never could own one such a beauty. But guys, if you have patience, sooner or later, some nice pieces will come to your life and to your collection. So again, I want to thank you, the, the seller, for giving me the opportunity to pay a decent sum of money of course it's not uh, uh, a steal but in my point of view I paid I paid quite uh, little for this kind of quality this is a beautiful beautiful fountain pen and in my point of view it it is worth 200 euros or 250 American dollars every day a wonderful wonderful piece so i will put it right here guys i hope you've enjoyed this quite unusual unboxing and it was unusual because of the sum of money i paid for this writing instruments i rarely pay this sum of money but i could not miss the opportunity to own such a beautiful parker with that gorgeous gorgeous nib at this wonderful wonderful price thank you for your time guys i want to wish you to have a wonderful day wherever you are i'm sure having a nice day after this unboxing so I'm speechless, the Parker is wonderful, the celluloids from the 1930s are uh, beauties and um, I'm quite, quite pleased with the price of money I paid for them. So guys, if you want to support my acquisitions and my journey through collecting fountain pens, please subscribe to my channel. In return, I will share with you all my emotions and um, i will uh, try to share with you all my unboxings of new and vintage fountain pens i got through the mails but also i will do their thorough reviews and maybe maybe those reviews will have information that might be of interest for you i am sorry guys i was quite in a hurry and this is like a um, correction video. So th the box included this set, but I forgot to show you that in the same pack, it was also included this uh, stamp holder, uh, the same matching the same materials and a bonus fountain pen from the seller, from the lady who sold me this set, uh, Pierre Cardon.
a beautiful beautiful elegant fountain pen it has a little bit of a problems and i will sh sh share them with you so first of all this protective uh, plastic should uh, remain in the cap and the nib is in really really bad shape but no problem it was a um, gift so i will uh, change uh, the nib and maybe this part or maybe i will find an entirely new grip section so this part should be compatible with other parts so maybe i will use this elegant elegant pierre cardon like this and maybe i will find a matching uh, grip section with the nib so this was my uh, extra video so i'm sorry guys sometimes when i get uh, really excited or when i'm filming these videos i've um, i've always uh, almost i uh, threw them on the trash but i uh, looked closely and uh, i could see the shiny of uh, this metallic piece so i thought to myself oh this set should have four pieces now i remember and this i almost forgot although the seller told me look i'm uh, including a blue fountain pen as a gift but i forgot guys about this aspect so i'm sorry but uh, i hope that uh, you can see the clear picture of this lot it was an interesting interesting lot i first bought those interesting 1930s pieces that this set which seems to me is quite quite a lovely set so not only a deep pen holder uh stamp one a mechanical pencil and a letter opener but i also had the chance to buy this incredible parker piece a wonderful beautiful piece thank you guys for your time i'm sorry for this little intermission in the video and i want to wish you to have a wonderful days bye bye so remember subscribe to my channel i will deliver uh, new content each and every day i hope uh, sometimes it is quite quite difficult with the editing of the video and i can't deliver a video each and every day but be sure that i will um, compensate by the quality of the content i hope that uh, i have interesting videos and i share with you interesting interesting writing instruments so have a wonderful day guys please take care of yourself in this pandemic time god bless and good luck to you bye bye